of the newest products you'll be buying to help you cook your meals, clean your home, and clear your clutter are being shown at the annual International Home and Housewares Trade Show in Chicago. BestStuff.com senior editor David Gregg is there with a sneak peek of some of this year's showstoppers. Morning, David. Hey, good morning, Harry. That's right. I'm right here in downtown Chicago at the McCormick Center. International Home and Houseware Show is a little different this year. They've got a very strong theme. It's not about practical. It's not about functional. It's about putting it all together with cool design. And this first thing is actually a vacuum cleaner. It's called the Track Vac, Harry. Let me put it on for you. Push the button. First thing, it says, gentlemen, start your engine. You put it down on the ground. And basically, instead of those robotic vacuums that right. you've seen, this one actually uses a remote control. Check this out. And it does a pretty good job of cleaning. <laughs> as you can see it picking up that lint right there it comes in all your favorite nascar players and uh let's stop it right there 250 bucks it even tells you when it needs to go to the pit to get some more juice there you go and that's available now by the way <laughs> let's go to a more conventional cleaner if possible this is an example as far as designed of what's old is what's new. Back in 1957, the Hoover Corporation created a vacuum, a canister vac called the Constellation. I remember Besides this. Besides being a 12-amp vacuum. Yeah, you remember this thing? It yeah. looks like this space-age orb. But what's unique about it is it's much more powerful. And check this out. It actually is a hovering vacuum. It's the Hoover Hovering Constellation. And if you look at the bottom, there are no wheels on this thing. Wow. So it's not going to mar up your floors. Love it. also it. uses HEPA filtration. Pretty cool, about 250 50 bucks that just came out. All right, let's talk about germs. I think we need to talk about germs for a while. Yeah, in light of recent events, everybody being a little germ phobic, maybe cutting back their spinach consumption. Mm -hmm. This may be a good solution for those people. This is interesting because it uses something that everybody has in their home, water. You put water in this tub right here. It's called the Lotus Sanitizing System and uses ozonating technology, which supercharges the water with oxygen. Push a button, it charges the water and actually removes all of the different bacteria, contaminants within about an eight minute period. So totally germ free, you don't have to worry. Also comes with this spray bottle that you connect mm -hmm. and ozonates the water and basically get rid of all your detergents because ozonated water, at least the claim they make it, it seems right. to be working, yes. removes stains so you can get rid of all of your different detergents and just use regular ozonated water, about $150. This was wow. actually a design award winner. That's pretty cool. Ozonated In water, I had never heard of that before. Ozonated water, it basically does the same thing to water that lightning mm -hmm. does to air. It cleans okay. it up ah, and charges cool. the water. Oh, that's cool. Okay. You go into an airport, Harry, mm -hmm. you clean your hands after, you know, doing what nature does naturally. Right, right. And you have to uh, get some soap out. Right. These are all the rage, all of these sensor products. Yeah. These are from Simple Human. It's a soap pump, about $40, comes in white and black, controls the amount of soap. There's hang on, hang on. Continuous Those press things button. never, excuse me, in, the, in public restrooms, especially in airports, they never work. Well, actually, you know, these do work, and here's another cool item. This, this is the iTouchless Towelmatic, about 60 bucks. Great way to control your towel uh, consumption here. Right, right. And again, I think the next thing you're going to see coming out in touchless technology that's sensor-driven are automatic flushing toilet bowls. Mothers across oh, the nation I'm will sure. rejoice. Yeah, exactly, especially if they have teenage sons. All right. <laughs> now, now, tell me about this. Is this kind of cool coffee and tea maker? Do you remember about a year and a half ago we did that coffee segment and the right. big introduction were all pod machines, they were right. all rage? Well, this yeah. is a little different. This is called the Bevio beverage system. Mm -hmm. It basically makes coffee and tea, but it uses these Bevio packets, right. which has a concentrate in it of coffee and tea. You put it in there, and the difference is with a... Uh, a regular pod, you only get one cup. With this, you control the amount of cups, and from each one of these Bevio flavor packets, you get between 15 to 18 cups of coffee or tea, and it all also automatically controls the brew cycle that you pick, and about $180 coming out in May wow, of this that's year. Really, all right, and the next thing is all about portion control. Yeah, if you're on a diet, you want to control the amount of cereal or your snacks that you're getting, you mm -hmm. definitely want to make sure that uh, you do control your portions. Here's a way to get your breakfast cereal or your snacks. It's a professional uh, dispenser from Zevro. It comes in a whole bunch of different colors. Another big theme at the show this year are these dispensers. They kind of look like gumball machines for right. your favorite treats. Right, well, they, they could look kind of cool in your kitchen if you had one of those. Yeah, kind of right. kind of a retro, kind of arcade look. And finally, right. this has right. got to be one of my favorites. Yes. All right, you got a romantic moment. Let me set the moment here for Please. you, Harry. You're Please sitting do. with your wife. Yes. It's Valentine's Day. It's your anniversary. Yeah. You got a bottle of bubbly, but you're concerned that, you know, it's going to kill the moment once that cork goes pop and hits the ceiling and the stuff sprays all over. Right. This is the Scruple cork remover for okay, champagne. Okay, Scruple makes wine. It very... They make cork removers for regular wine bottles. So, uh, so yep. Exactly. Now, look at this. The cork is moving slowly, but watch. Boom! That's, is that too cool? That is pretty cool.
I wish we had David Letterman instant replay and we yeah. do it again, but that's about $20 and it's available now. And that's just a, a slight recap of some of the showstoppers mm. at this year's International Home and Houseware Show. And David, I think the cork catcher wins. I think that may be the uh, most winning, uh, winning thing of the day. All right, very good, very good. Come, coming, at, coming at you, Harry. More, Here more, comes. Oh! oh. <laughs> now, did you see what happened there? It caught the cork, but did it stop the blast? Yeah. Let, me, here, let me wipe you off here. All right, all right Thanks, you're, you're all cleaned all up, Harry. Right. David Gregg right, in Chicago. You Thank you so much. Good job. <laughs> now, here's Hannah. I like that cork catcher, too. Thanks, Harry.